In addition to responding to the acts of violence that took place over the weekend, Louisville Metro Council is proposing a way to address these incidents quickly in the future. Caleb Shepard often frequents businesses on Bardstown Road with friends and found the news of Sunday's deadly shooting inside Cafe 360 concerning. It's really easy for one person or one group of people who just feel like today's that day to ruin a good time for what is just good people and good citizens wanting to enjoy themselves. Louisville Metro Council member Ben Reno Weber agrees, which is why the city asked the state to suspend the restaurant's license. We are asking for an emergency revocation of the license for Cafe 360 to operate. We're asking for an ordinance change that will enable us to locally decide on those kinds of emergency shutdowns. Metro Council, Mayor Greenberg's office, and Metro Alcohol Beverage Control support a proposed ordinance to give local officials the ability to issue an emergency license suspension. So Metro ABC Administrator Brad Silveria can act quickly. I hope it has an effect in Louisville. We'll be responsive and we're able to hold the licensee accountable if there is accountability to be levied against the business. Reno Weber says the proposal would only grant Metro Authority the same suspension power as the state. It mirrors the state's language. I mean, this is not new, but this gives us more local control to respond exactly to the needs of our neighbors. They say combating violence and keeping people safe at local bars and restaurants is the goal, which sits well with customers like Caleb. You want to bring people to this area, but you want to bring them here safely because this is a thriving place. We spoke with the owner of Cafe 360 and he declined an interview with us. In Deer Park neighborhood, Norman Seawright, WLKY News. And the